LLMs are advancing quickly and they are offering immense potential. As a result, businesses are employing LLMs for addressing specific needs and harnessing their power. There are over hundreds of applications driven by LLMs already in the market and in the use. And some of the popular examples being GitHub Copilot. It's the world's most widely adopted AI tool for developers. It can write the code for us on a fly. Today, more than 37,000 plus businesses and one in every three Fortune 500 companies have already adopted GitHub Copilot. It enhances the productivity of the developers by more than 50%. The next one is 10web.io. 10web.io lets you create a website in seconds just by answering a few questions. Today, with the power of LLMs, anyone from non-developer background can build a website instantly without writing a single line of code. The next one is Jasper.ai, an AI writing assistant powered by LLMs. With Jasper.ai, you can create a high quality content for blogs and email campaigns instantaneously. Time has quickly changed, isn't it? Earlier, it would have taken nearly two weeks of effort to write a high quality blog and then editing it and then uh, seeing whether it is relevant or not. But in today's world with LLMs, it hardly takes a few seconds to write a high quality blog. The next one is chat PDF. Chat PDF lets you chat with any of the PDF documents, be it research papers, blogs, books, etc. Picture being able to upload your favorite book and then having a chat with it and ask about the roles, the characters. Isn't that cool? Likewise, there are many applications powered by LLMs today across different domains like healthcare, finance, e-commerce, so on and so forth. So the question is, how can we build these kind of LLM applications? And that is what we'll discuss in this particular course. So primarily, there are four different methods to build LLM applications. The first one is called prompt engineering. The second one is retrieval augmented generation, popularly known as RAG. Third one is fine tuning LLMs. And the fourth one is training LLMs from scratch. These are the four different ways to develop LLM applications.